So I'm going to take a cutting from this plant because she does have quite a few long trails. I do keep getting tangled. Um, I'm not sure quite where to take one from. I'm thinking here as it looks like it could do with getting a bit bushier. Yeah, I'm going to take that there. So what I've learned from the YouTube videos is to cut between the nodes um, but cut close, as close as I can on this side and then obviously trim it back here, dip this end in the ro rooting hormone and um, take away these bottom leaves so that they're not in the water as they'll just rot and then within well within my experience at the moment um probably seven days and there'll be roots um i've not actually put any in soil yet so i'm going to attempt to put some in soil probably tomorrow as there's some roots on so i'm just going to take this cut in we'll go there and hopefully now that'll bush out a little bit. She's not looking too leggy at the moment, but she's not quite as thick as the Zembrina variety, which I've got, which seems really bushy. This seems quite leggy on top and to be trailing down, which I don't mind because she can sit on the top of my unit. Um, right, so now I'm going to cut. I'm not sure how good my camera is. Quite an old phone. I'm just going to cut off that little piece of stem there because that's quite redundant. And then I'm just going to pinch off these bottom leaves. It's weird because I don't actually like taking cuttings from the plants. But then when I see the roots and the fact that there's a new plant, I like it. Right, so that is what the cutting looks like and I'm just going to dip again in the rooting powder which was three pounds from Wilkinson's for a giant tub me and my mum shared it that's why mine's in a body butter <laughs> a body butter um go on tub right I'm going to make sure there's plenty on there and then all I do is pop her inside the tube if I can get it out. There's just some water in this tube. So I'm just going to pop her inside there. And then she'll sit nice on the top. And again, pop her somewhere warm and in the light. And we shall get some roots.